So, ladies and gentlemen, it's time to go to the puzzle. Oh my goodness. Okay, so that's not too bad. We managed to get, you know, I keep seeing black moss now, even though it's not even there. But yeah, the atmosphere in this game, holy mackerel. Okay. Anyway, we're back to the main area, which is good, but we've got three figurines. But I think we need four. Skeleton figure. I'm the strongest. It's got, got to be some, like, super strong one, surely. I can't fly. Surely that's this one. And then I can walk. Probably snail. I'm alive. Probably skeleton. But we're missing. I'm the strongest. And I bet, you know, we get it through this scroll rock sword. So, I've got to try and figure that out. And then we can come back here. I actually don't think that's designed to be a confusing problem. I'm probably just being dumb. <laughs> ah, man. All right, so we get there through this one here. And I'll see you guys in a minute. Ah, I bet there's something back here that's got like a gemstone um, or pal gem. Because, you know, I have been kind of lacking that I haven't really found any yet um, since coming back after playing this for like three months. So, uh, it's kind of my bad, you know. But um, let's keep analyzing. I'm sure we'll get there. Right. Scroll. Rock. Sword. Sword. Rock. Scroll. Have to be a particular scroll. It's a recipe. Nice, okay. The reason I did that was so that we could learn a new spell. And let's teach this to you as well. And then, I know I'm kind of, you know, Turning the lights on and off, but uh, see if that sort of works. This is Scroll of Fireball, we know that. Scroll of Shield, we know this. Nice. Scroll of Light, know that one. Scroll of Force Field, know that one. Okay. Okay. <laughs> um, I was just messing around <laughs> and <laughs> I put them all in different ones. I was just like messing. And the door opened. I don't know whether that's a glitch or not. Whoa! Okay. Okay. Holy moly. Uh, hello. Right, I, I don't really want to play with you. Oh, blimey. Okay. Why? Why is this a thing? Oh, my goodness. These dudes. Whoa! Come on. Nice. Oof. Right, okay then. There's a green thing up there, I want it. So as I was saying before I was rudely interrupted, I got an ogre figurine. Oh, nice. Yeah, I was just messing around, and suddenly, this thing just opened. And how on earth do we get up there? I really want that green thing. I don't know what it is, but I want it. So I think I've got to probably... Some sort of idea how we get there. Or not. Huh. Man, I want this green thing. Sheesh. <laughs> oh, okay. So something to the right here. Uh, green thing. So I'm going to quickly grab that if I can figure out how. I bet you there's a button that we have to press in here or something. How else would we get there? Probably back here. Oh yes! So I finally found it. I had searched everywhere, but I was thinking, you know, it would be something, you know, something in this sort of line of path. So I was just gradually checking. So that is something with this game. Um, I don't know what this does, but it's uh, it looks important. So we'll put this here, the two skulls here, next to the food, you know, <laughs> cross contamination and all that. So uh, protection plus 25 for 40 seconds. Wowzers. Okay, that is cool. I've never got that before, but um, I'm glad I got that. So yeah, if you guys need any advice on how to find these sort of like hidden secrets, I think. 
my best advice would be just look in the vicinity for little buttons like that and try and piece it together on the map so I could kind of see that I don't know why I'm putting it on the screen but you know I can kind of see that there was sort of link there or something and I could see it was to the right because the other one was open as well so I was looking for something that might connect up so I'm glad about that and now I mean I don't know why I'm chatting like I'm a pro because <laughs> I still don't know the um I still don't know the code unfortunately and it taken I've probably missed so many different things as well so let's put this here and this is not the right one so I'm the strongest should be the ogre right I'm a live skeleton it's kind of the opposite right I can walk I can't fly all right I tell you what let's try this again uh, let's give them to you give them to you I'm gonna put this up here I have a full row of them. Am I being dumb? I mean, always. <laughs> but, um... What is this? I'm alive. So what is alive? Ogre, Crowan, Snail... I don't even know what a Crowan is. So I'm going to go with this. Snail. Um, I can walk. Skeleton can walk. I can't fly. Ogres can't fly. No, surely... Surely it must be the polar opposites, right? So, surely can't fly must be the crow one. I can walk must be the snail. Maybe. I don't know about that one. Um, I'm alive. Skeleton. Am I being silly? It surely is these things, right? And that is the that is the entrance to the lexicoinery, so we're definitely right. So, I'll tell you what, I'm going to I don't know if we're right, but I'm just going to mess around with the order and see if we can sort of solve it. So I'll tell you what, I'm going to be back in a second, and I'll meet you guys in a moment. Okay, guys, I'm completely baffled. Like, I can't fly. Like, I, I don't know, I've got a theory that surely this is the snake. I mean, the snail, sorry. But I don't know about this... Um, this one here, I've put the skeleton in I can walk, just because I'm thinking it can walk, but I don't know whether I'm going for the polar opposites or, you know, the real ones, and I'm alive, I, I don't even know whether that's that one, so this one I'm kind of confused about, and there's also this um, the current Vigorine. The only one I haven't really tried is, oh, sorry, let me do that quickly, the only option I haven't really tried is putting the Crowan in... I don't even know what a Crowan is, but I'm... I don't even know, man. And then, um... The Ogre figurine could go in here. Oh, Sheesh! So I guess the answer is just to try all the combinations and then see. <laughs> nice! Anyway, we've got another Crystal Flower, which is super duper useful. I can't remember what they give. I think they may even give permanent increases, which is really good. And got some bear pelt, vitality plus two, resist cold plus twenty, uh, which is always nice. And then we've got the scroll, which is oh, ho, ho. finally, finally, oh yes, that helps a lot ladies and gentlemen i am so proud and let's not forget this almost forgot the power cell oh yes so you know i mean we're not doing too great with the power cells but i mean i know the power jams but i don't even care right so this is this note wherever it is where is this oh it's a scroll never mind uh, this scroll is really 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 important so I would usually skip this out, but because it's part of the fun, I'm going to leave it in. So uhu, u equals forward. Um, R is left, and lam is back, right? So I shouldn't say that. I just mean back. Uh, T is right, and E is one na is two okay that is revolutionary as you guys might not realize but that means that we can actually go back here and solve where is it here 
Here we are, the archives, we can go to the translate button. So I'll see you guys in a minute. Okay guys, right. I realize I have to, <laughs> I'm so glad I wrote this down because, um, yeah, that's how we solve it, right? So it's got to be Uhu Na is the first one. So that's forward two. The question is, where do we start? I'm guessing we start here. So it's forward two. And then it's R E, which is left one. Okay, then it's T Na. So that's right two. And then it's Lam E which is back one then it's ah na which is um left two oh yes <laughs> i don't believe it ladies and gentlemen that has uncovered the next piece of the puzzle Dis dear visitor made it this far already splendid seal in this vault Sealed in this vault are the fragments of a tale that tells the pilgrim from that tells of a pilgrim from Zafi. My father passed the story to me, and now it is my time to pass it forward. Sincerely, the Island Master. Oh my goodness! All right, before we do anything, I'm going to grab one of these. I don't know what they do, but I'm sure that they really worth it, right? So, I've got another letter. Oh right, okay, let's. Okay, tell you what, I'm gonna drop all of these. Or what is this one? He then then he looked at the path leading to the burning hot desert he called home. So this is what I'm thinking is right, the answers lie in the archives is what the graveyard uh, said. So these are the hints to solve that puzzle. So we're now on the next puzzle, which is you know I'm gonna leave them. I'm gonna put them up like here maybe and then I'm gonna put these ones down here and this one here um, just to sort of organize the inventory a little bit more he began traveling towards the frozen tundras the Sun was setting so that is someone I don't know exactly and this one is finally the star of the north came to lead the way and he continued walking along the path Blimey, oh, alright. I don't know how much help that's going to be. But, um, I guess we've got to use those somewhere in the graveyard. And man, oh man, this game is... I'm invested, holy moly. I really don't want to put it down. And <laughs> now, I'm going to try and go for this one. So, bear with me while I write it down. In fact, I'm going to cut ahead, and I'll see you guys in a minute. Okay, guys. Alright, so... This one is much more confusing because it's got ones that we don't know on it, so we have to sort of guess them. And it's got Pala. Uh, it's got Pala twice, so I guess that means n full stop or nothing. I don't know. And Fam Ko and Lam Ko. I don't know what Fam means. So. I'm gonna have to guess. If Lam is back, Fam must mean. Oh, I've got no clue. But let's try this. Okay, so Te is right. Um. Okay, right. Then U Na is forward two. Then Pala, which I'm gonna leave because I don't know what that is. Um, unless does it say anything about Pala? What, is, what, is, what on earth does this even mean? The, the, um, the sort of like, go that way. P-A-L-A. -A. I am stumped on that. Does it mean you go... I think what it means is that you go in like a one, two, three, something like that, alright? 
that's my guess. So I'm gonna have to redo it, unfortunately. Um, but that is probably Pala is pointing to the left, and Fam. Wait, hold on. Let's work this out. So, um, Lamb is back. So what is Fam? <laughs> I'm gonna guess Pala is this way which I'm writing down I know you guys can't see so I'm gonna I'm gonna guess this one the one on the left is Pam and the or Pala sorry and the one on the right is Fam and if not we should try it again so this may be confusing actually it's very confusing but I'm gonna give it my best go and see if we can get it so Uhuna is U forward. Uh, sorry, Uhuna is forward two. I'm reading the wrong one. Damn it. Um, te is right. So U na is forward two. Oh, sorry for the darkness. Uh, you can do that. There we are. Uh, then Pala is one, two, three. And then U na. Okay, so tell you what, I can't do that because it takes me off of the map, so I'm actually going to reverse that as this one here, and I know you guys can't see, but I'm going to show the screen in a minute. Um, so I've, what I've done is, because that didn't actually work out, I'm going to switch these between each other, right? And I'm going to try that again, and I know this is slightly tedious, but this is part of the game, this is part of the fun, and I hope that you guys will see that I'm trying my best to work it out. <laughs> Got my good old pen and paper, and there are no other puzzles like this in the game, don't worry. This is the one unique one, and I really like it, actually. I think it's pretty cool. But, uh, Te is... So let's do this one more time. Here we go. Uh, Te, right, here we go. U, Na is forward two. And now we go... Ah, well, hold on a minute. So Pala is... Forward, ooh, nah, it's forward two, which puts me in here. And then it's power. Okay, no, I've kind of messed up there. I don't know what I've done. I am so confused. Okay, guys, I've done a lot of thinking. <laughs> And a lot of writing down, but basically, I sort of figured that instead of it meaning that you have to move these squares, how about it means if you rotate them? So I'm kind of thinking that is probably the way that we have to go because otherwise we're going out of the squares. So let's try this again. One, two, three, and then Pala means... I, I'm going to start with it meaning that so you rotate 270 degrees to the left, one, two, three, all right, okay, U, na is next, U is forward, two, okay, never mind, so we can't do that, so I'm guessing it must mean this way then, oh, it's which I could have flipping done without resetting, but okay, so then we go 270 to the right, is one, two, three, and then U, na is forward, two, and then Pala Na, so that's Pala again, 270 to the right, one, two, three. Let me write this down, hold on. Uh, P A L A equals 270 right. And uh, Fam, I guess, is 270 to the left. Oh, fiddle six. Which one am I on now? Pala Na, okay. 270 to the right. Oh goodness, I shouldn't have written down that halfway through the sentence. Um, ah, <laughs> oops. Um, so I started there, went this way, came this way, 270 to the right. So nice. Okay, now we do na, which is two. Um, then we do ar, which is left, two. 
don't know about that. And then it's Fam Co. So that's 270 to the left. One, two, three. And then the Co, I'm guessing, is three. If we've got one and two. So that was three there. And then finally, we've got Lam Co. Just Lam back. One, two, three. Damn! No, it's not correct! Huh, let me try that again. Hold on. Okay, guys, I am back. Oh my god, this is so confusing. I'm literally, like, racking my brain here. I think I've got to A-R-E, as done, and now I'm on Fam Co. So that means 270 degrees rotate to the left. Alright. And then three this way. Alright, and then... Oh! Okay. That was not intentional. I still had... I still had more... More of my code to do. <laughs> what? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Listen, I was almost at the end, right? I just had a lamb code to do. But I... I don't even know. But I'm taking this... I'm taking this Dragon Breath Revolver. I'm taking these lockpicks. Oh my... Goodness. So literally, I followed that exactly, but I got I got to Lam Famco, but I didn't even do Lamco. Huh. Very strange. But and anyway, what is this Dragon's Breath revolver? I bet you it's much better than this. Is seven to twenty-one, and this is eleven to thirty-three. Range three. What's so special about it? So it does a little bit more damage. Cooldown is... Oh, much better. Right, okay. Firearms 3. Reload powerful. Runes and enchantments are inscribed upon this weapon. To keep its mechanisms working. Ooh, okay. Tell you what, I really want to try that. So I want my human to get the firearm now. Damn. So all of that for... Oh, yeah. And also, we've definitely given you the... Uh, Tome of Strength, just because of how, you know, I think that would be super duper useful, right? Because you do so much damage. But then again, you get strength through skulls, so I think it's actually probably better to give it to Bob. Because, you know, I mean, why not? But sheesh, oh my goodness. Right, ladies and gentlemen, that was blooming difficult. Oh my goodness, I am tired after that. <laughs> oh, wow. But anyway, I believe now, ladies and gentlemen, it is time for us to see if we can get revenge on those blasted um, enemies. Those rat monsters. Sheesh. So that is the plan. And then after that, because, I mean, we've improved our strength so much, right? Um... Oh, also, did I grab the sword? I did not. That would have been a very smart thing to do. Um, damn it. Okay, you know what? I'm going to go back very quickly and grab the sword from uh, the Lexicoinery, which I know is a very, very long way away. Oh, good thing I spot this blood drop cap. So I'll be back in a minute. Okay, ladies and gentlemen. So what I've got now is I thought I had dual wield uh, with this. Which is a bit weird. Why do I not have dual wield? Uh, a third skill level, you can dual wield light weapons as long as one of them is a dagger. Okay, so we've got so much to level up Sam with. Sheesh. Okay, well that's, that's not as brilliant as I first thought, but it does do a lot of damage, so we are still improved. So that's pretty darn useful, I must say. And as a result, all of our troops are now stronger, so I believe. Also, we do have this uh, Shard of Crystal Healing, which raises all of our dead troops back to life. So, I do believe, although it's going to be tough, hopefully we should have enough to take on these Rat Kingdom dudes now. Man, oh man. Ugh. They're not very nice, but we can do this. Okay, guys, next time we shall take on the Rattling Kingdom. See you then, folks.